everyone welcome back to math on the matter um if you're new here make sure to like and make sure to subscribe to fun time here and uh yeah if you're also new here like the framework of the way these things go is that i talk about the plot of the webtoon that i'm gonna you know i've, I've read the plot then the characters then my likes and dislikes then i talk about a theory so theory time um then i give it a rating then my final thoughts so yeah make sure to strap in make sure to watch this to the end and uh yeah so today's one is about death that's the webtoon we're going to be talking about about death by Cini and hoyan i think one is the artist and then the other one is the writer i i think i think don't hold me to that uh yeah so going right into the plot so the plot is basically about this borderline between life and death where god the character god literally meets like these people you know and um he confronts them or he chills with them or he talks with them and i think he kind of gets them to sort of like go into this new world what has been like he's been very like adamant about is that no one can be revived you know what i mean once you're dead you're dead that's it and then he kind of ushers you into this like what's this world like where you're reborn again you know um but sometimes this place is kind of like just between life and death where they may be about to die and then they meet him so yeah it's cool it's cool so on to my likes and dislikes likes first um the first one is i really like the minimalist arts like the art is I, I i fucking love the art um most of it is done in black and white and that's to kind of represent the kind of like borderline that they're in black and white when it's in color like you know that they're in the real world um they're on earth you know and uh yeah i i, I also really fucking love that they kind of draw what they need to you know what i mean like they're very that minimalist approach they don't fuck they don't feel the borders of like they don't feel the panels they don't feel the borders they just they just kind of they don't they're not afraid of leaving space which i kind of like i don't know why but it's cool you know they just give it what they need to um they don't feel the entire panels and it's cool it's nice it's it's very um it's very clean you know um next thing is that the music was nice you know it added i can't remember if there was music in every single episode i can't really remember but there was music in quite a few of the episodes and um it gave it like a nice introspective sort of atmosphere it was cool uh next thing is that i liked god's style and i wasn't the only one that thought so he was so cool i mean we'll get to him later but like i i mean yeah this just comes to my next point like he was so laid back he was so chill like i wouldn't mind kicking him back with this god like to be fucking honest guys you need to read this webtoon just so you can like just so ju just so you could just meet this 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 god like character just so you can read about him you know what i mean just because he's so cool he's honestly so cool like god I, ugh. next thing is that um i like that i had like an episode of the day type feel um I like that I wasn't following sort of like some sort of rigid narrative. I mean, in some chapters, some chapters would be linked. So maybe there'll be like, a, I think it would be like 16.5 and a 17. Or maybe there'll be like chapter 14. And then let's say chapter 17 would have been linked to that chapter. But like, I'm sure at the end, it sort of seems like they were all loosely linked. But um, it wasn't, it wasn't like following originality was like this this cast of different people who don't know each other and all that shit who don't who loosely don't know each some did know each other but yeah it was it was cool it was cool it was very nice um next thing that i like the different people's reactions to knowing that oh they're either nearly dead or they're dead or you know just meeting god you know what i mean it was quite cool like it kind of reminded me of the stages of um grief you know it was like oh i saw like shock and denial i saw pain and guilt anger and bargaining depression um acceptance like yeah i saw those varying different those varying emotions like i saw it and it was quite cool it's quite cool it's quite interesting to see and i sort of understood where the emotions were coming from by knowing the backstories so that was nice 
uh the next thing that i like the different lessons that um they sort of put into every story without it being too overbearing you know what i mean it wasn't too it wasn't like they were trying to hammer in a lesson for you to know it was like yeah and it wasn't i know it has not much of an explanation but it wasn't it wasn't too like like oh the episode's wrapping up let's put a resolution onto this you know what i mean it was it was, it was okay um oh okay so next one is what kind of twist did you expect this is what i like that's the only thing i put inside my notebook and it relates to this scene where this guy had died right and God was just telling him about... I, I can't remember what God was telling him about. But my guy really fully thought that he'd be able to, like, get resurrected. And... Uh-uh. No, it didn't happen. Like, I was so shocked. I was so, like, wow. You mean you're like this? You mean it's like this? Like, I knew what it was for. But at the same time... Okay, so what happens that the guy really expected to get resurrected. You know what I mean? And then God was like no my guy you're dead what kind of twist did you expect here and it was like some kind of character it was like some kind of fourth wall break because he was looking right at the p i was like nah nah that's not cool that's really not cool like uh, for fourth char for character wall breaks for fourth wall breaks like that was a pretty good one that was a pretty good one sometimes when i see wall um fourth wall breaks i'm like mm, no not that cool you haven't built up that amount of like like points with me for you able to do all that kind of shit it's not that cool you haven't done that but in this case god i mean the god character in this he had built up those points he was quite cool i was like okay we see you we see you he fully looked at us and was like what kind of twist did you expect i was like oh duly noted okay i won't do it again because like the way they had done it like quite a few of the episodes had been like prior to this one had been like yeah he had been um giving them a second chance on life you know what i mean like they didn't end up dying dying you know what i mean um but this one nah my guy was dead and he was like you're dead you just have to go be reborn what kind of twist did you expect i was like oh okay uh the next thing is that i like the little clues oh yeah okay so i like the little clues in the chapters like like let's say i got to a chapter and i was like oh okay and then i went back to previous chapter and um like the previous like okay so one example was that um this guy this guy's wife i really want to go into the entire story of this guy because it oh okay so this guy's wife um he was talking about okay so this guy was talking about his wife and how his wife um um cries when she cuts her fingers right and then in chapters that had passed we came back to see the woman's death from her own perspective um and what had happened was that in the story, the woman, she had cut her finger and um, she didn't want to remove the band-aid because she was like, shit, I, I don't like the sight of blood. So I'm, I'm only going to remove it when I'm sure that it's healed. And I was like, oh, oh, okay. I see, I, you, like, I see what you did there. I see what you did there. So it was cool. Uh, it was cool. Um, the next thing is that, oh, okay. That my man just can't wrap itself on the fact that this god character like my guys i know i cannot emphasize it enough but he is too cool he's too cool and he's too fine too like he's quite fine i know i'm missing the point whatever the point is of focusing on this guy's like like aesthetic but gosh i mean it works it works guys i like it oh what he looks great like his hair like his goatee everything you know what i mean like he's got that swagger like i'm like oh oh i mean he knows that's the kind of man that knows he just knows his power he knows his own his own potent he knows like his omniscience he just fucking knows and you know that kind of coolness that you get from knowing that you're an all-powerful being like fuck we stand we love to see it like oh 
and he smokes too and i don't support smoking this is not me endorsing smoking okay this is me saying that the aesthetic of a fictional character smoking that i can see before me as it is drawn is quite he looks cool doing it okay but yeah don't don't smoke but um yeah oh there was one scene when he removed his beanie like guys he removed his beanie and we'll get to these fucking beanies he removed his beanie and then he ran his fingers through his hair back i was like oh okay like okay um next point it just it makes sense guys like it makes sense everything he does it makes sense the aesthetic of him makes sense it just ah oh, chef's kiss uh, next thing, he, the way he is around kids, like the way he is, like there's a difference, you know, there's a difference between the way he acts around kids and the way he acts around adults. Like it's not like he's he's bad to adults in any way, shape, or form. You know what I mean? But you know that Gordon Ramsay meme that was floating around, like Gordon Ramsay to adult chefs and Gordon Ramsay to kid chefs. It's kind of that way. It's kind of that way. He's not rude. But like at the same time, he's very frank, if that makes sense. He can be, he can be tender, you know, but, um, and he can be, what's the thing? Very like understanding and trying to like converse and just trying to do everything with adults. But most of the time he's quite frank, like, yeah. But with kids, he's just so tender. He's just so, he's just, just so cute. He just, just trying to be very accommodating so on and so forth you know what i mean it's, it's very cute uh, like I, I i like it you know um but i guess that's how you kind of have to be with kids kids are really innocent in a lot of fucking things like i was just saying a lot of things in, in in almost everything you know so when they die it's kind of like the worst thing Ugh. okay next thing is dislikes um Okay, so first thing that's a it's a bit confusing. It is a bit confusing. Like every single episode I would have to consult the, the um comment section like oh what happened in here? I don't know what happened, but it's cool, but let me just make sure, you know, so I'd have to go to the comment section quite a bit, you know, just to reacquaint myself with what just happened and understand it. Uh next thing is that I won't say that there is only one song playing, but the songs are quite similar. So when you're listening to, not listening to this, when you're reading this in quite like close like proximity or in quite close like, um, I don't know how to explain it, but when you're reading this one after the other, like one chapter after the other, like it's going to get rather repetitive. Like it sounds the same. You know what I mean? It sounds the same. I'm not sure what the upload schedule for this was, but I assume it was maybe like once a week. So with people who are reading it once a week or something, like it probably won't be as obvious. You know what I mean? If it's a weekly thing, you're coming back, you're probably not like guessing the music. You're not like, you're not, you're not clocking the fact that this music is sounding the same. Well, but if you're reading it like one chapter the other, like I was, so I could get a review out. Um, yeah, it sounded very repetitive and it kind of got just a tiny bit annoying. The music was good. It was just yeah at some point i mean it's not such a bad thing i mean i switched off the music or i just like blocked out the music from my mind because it wasn't that important and uh yeah the next thing is that the accent of god powers is kind of vague like you don't really explain it but at the same time i guess i guess his powers aren't really that important all you need to know is that hey this is the borderline and um although he can't did he say he could do anything i don't know he would probably do anything but at the same time he said i'm not as powerful as you think i'm kind of, i don't know i don't know i don't know it's kind of vague it's kind of vague but it was probably maybe it was intentionally vague i'm not sure but yeah the next thing is that the solutions for you know i mean the people who come to the borderline quite a few of them They've had some problems in their lives you know stuff like that um the solutions that kind of seem to be what was heralded i don't know just seemed a bit overly simplistic you know i don't know i don't know for me they just felt a bit overly simplistic like do you really think that's 
going to solve whatever this person is going through you know but at the same time hey like you know i just i guess that's that's maybe what they're trying to convey i mean with the simple minimalistic arts maybe with the whole entire like oh there's this um it's life and death it's simple two simple concepts you know what i mean like um so yeah i don't know i don't know you tell me uh comment down below because i'm not sure the next yeah okay so that kind of wraps up my dislikes i think i'm finished with that uh so theory time i don't really have a theory per se um and i think the only theory i would have would probably be pertaining to the creators plural intentions and they sort of kind of like left these examples stand by their own and by examples i mean these characters these people who came into contact with the borderline you know what i mean because they sort of stand as representations for the entire human race you know what i mean just they kind of picked different situations and then showed it to us i so in that vein i can't really bring myself to like say a theory because these characters they don't really they're not really meant to do much for me you know what i mean they don't not do much for me like i i didn't really get attached to any single character i can't tell you any single character's names truly like truly i can't remember any single one you know what i mean it's just really the they're just they're just vessels for the stories which you're kind of meant to get attached to i guess the stories not the characters so i can't really be out here being like oh i have a theory that this character is going to do this or this nah 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 i just i just no i don't think you know i just can't really see myself even like giving a theory you know what i mean so i think the stories are what you're supposed to be like wow yeah not really the characters you know so a rating i'm going to give this an 8.5 9 out of 10 maybe an i don't know i crossed those 8 to 9 8 to 9 because i'm not sure i'm really not sure you know what i mean it was it was quite good you know like ah uh, we just have to talk about this god like god on his own deserves a 10 out of 10 a 20 out of 10 even like god like oh his drip guys it's excessive his drip you just have to read it if solely you read this just to see what i'm talking about go and read it just to see what i'm talking about his guys oh he knows his style he knows his style he knows what works for him and we love to see it like oh he pulls through the bucket hats the overalls track suits oversized jacket the suits guys the suits you know oh the coats the beanies guys the beanies the glasses Eww. my guy's a style icon style icon simple done period done and dusted like god put some respect on his name because what what and like every new chapter my guy just strolls in he just strolls in looking fine you know what i mean he's a, he's a man after my own heart like truly 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 like this is what what like this is what my own boyfriend needs to be looking like this is what he needs to be looking like because it works it works this is what i like you know what i mean and it works it makes sense guys like ah uh, he wants him to do formal he can do it streets done checked whatever casual night right off his alley like don't question him don't question if even just to to get style inspo from this guy go and read this just go and read about death like go and read about the death like you came for the stories of these people but you stayed for his drip like that's that's basically about the death you know what i mean like oh it was so good um so onto like the actual stories themselves i'd have to say my favorites would be episode 16 um because it was so cute um there wasn't a lot of words going on um wasn't a lot of dialogue it was kind of just pictures what happened was that this guy this old man had come um and um what the way they were sort of showing the passage of time of this guy's life was this like photo cards of him and his own friends i think there were five other friends so as the photo cards began to progress as they got older you could see how diff um, some of the friends were leaving the photos because they had died um 
and then he met his friends once he came to this borderline and they all took another picture together and you could see that they had all they were all um they all looked at the age when they had died so when the last photograph was taken and i was like oh wow this is really cute it was it was really heartwarming you know there was no i don't think there was any kind of like they didn't go to earth or anything because they had died it was it was quite it was really cute guys it was really cute it was really heartwarming um yeah like i said there wasn't like a lot of dialogue in this i think the only thing that was said was maybe like god was like all right guys ready to go say cheese because he was taking the final picture for them i was like oh you know so yeah and then i think the next one that i really like was episode 20 so there was this guy who came and he was just he was on par with like what god was saying i enjoyed to see this kind of like intellectual kind of thing he was just like they were just playfully having conversation i think they were trying to feel each other out they were giving out like apparently i went to like the comment section and they were really like talking um spitting texts about confucius um which i think is philosophy um they were just giving and i actually went to go um is it raining it's actually raining outside they actually i actually went to go on internet and i was like oh um confucius text about death you know like what it relates to death not about the story but just um you know about death and um i actually saw one of the quotes that one the character um this new character was talking about um how can i be something about death pertaining to life like how can i make sense of death when i don't even understand life or something like that and i was like oh okay like it just seems so intellectual guys the conversation that was going on i was like what it was so cool they felt it felt like they were equals you know what i mean they felt like it was a match and i was like oh it's just so good to see it's just so good to see they just they were like pals they were like oh they were just walking they both were smoking they both like to smoke they both were talking some intellectual shit waxing philosophies it was nice it was really nice to see my guy just left into to be reborn quietly like it didn't make it was just so cool like i felt like if he probably gave him um god probably gave this character like a like a like a hat off like a oh good sir you are my match because it was really good it was really good so yeah that kind of wraps up my final thoughts about it. it's good i'd recommend reading it it was it was quite nice it was quite really nice um yeah so if you like this video make sure to like make sure to subscribe and uh, make sure to comment guys commenting i honestly really want to know your thoughts like i want to know if like you're like nah tt you're wrong you're wrong square up because you're wrong you know what i mean like your opinions they just in queue or you could just be like yeah tt completely validated what i've been thinking all this time thank you for saying it you know and uh yeah so this has been mouth in the matter bye